Andy Mendoza alongside Coach Tracy Johnson and Coach Johnson, an absolutely dominating performance by your girls today, 10 to nothing. What do you attribute to the dominating performance, really? I think, you know, it's easy to look at a game where you score a lot of goals and, and uh, say that it was um, a dominating performance by them. Certainly it was outcome-wise. Um, I think that we could probably be a little better and clean up some of our play, actually, um, and would like to see a little bit more um, of our level of play. Sometimes it's difficult when you're playing against teams um, you know that you're scoring a lot at, but I think there are things we can do better on the ice for sure. Yeah. And and obviously uh, Chelsea Blackburn with the with the hat trick and the assist, and she she has to see on her sweater for a reason. What can you say about her play this season as a senior, and and obviously today? I think tonight she played great. Um, she was out hustling everybody out there. She was trying to make plays. She was not being a selfish player, and somehow still finding the back of the net three times herself. And um, you know, she just plays with a lot of heart, a lot of passion, and a uh, fun player to watch, and always has been and, and will be for the remainder of the season. Obviously, uh, the shutout helps. Whenever, whenever you shut the other team out, there's a good chance you're going to win. Uh, what do you attribute the shutout to? Was it DeRosa in goal? Was it the defense? It seemed like they really played well hand-in-hand -hand together. Yeah, uh, you know, we obviously didn't give up a whole lot of shots. So as a goaltender, it's it's tough to hang in those games when you're not seeing a ton of pucks. It's spending more time in the in the opponent's zone than it is our own. So uh, very glad that she was able to stay dialed in and make the saves when, he, when we needed her to, especially in that third period. Um, right out the gate, those first few minutes, you know, we really needed her dialed in, and she did that. You mentioned cleaning a few things up. Obviously, you face the same team again tomorrow afternoon. So what do you tell your ladies tonight and tomorrow to not get too high, not to get too low, but to, to stay focused heading into tomorrow's game. Yeah, we need to be focused on making better passes and making quicker decisions and picking our heads up. I think there were lots of opportunities there where we could have made good plays, and instead we were taking our time with the puck a little bit more, and uh, you know, we need to take those opportunities to get better at those things, and uh, we just need to focus in on that for tomorrow. Thanks so much, Coach. Appreciate the time. Thank you. Andy Mendoza here with GoMustangSports.com.